connections. The mainland and Sodor had always had a great connection and the Roadwork Railway was no different. With our connection we had our own Sodor engine working with our railway and this engine was named Bear. Bear is a Hymet diesel who pulls the Lake Mainland Limited, previously known as just the Limited. This connection would transfer trains to Orville who will take the rest of the train to Fairview. How do you feel about retiring this train then, matey? To be honest, I'm a little sad though. I can't complain. Uh, I hear the new engine will do the job quite nicely. Uh. Hmm, I dare say. Early that morning, Orville arrived at Barrow and Furness to see a Class 40 on Platform 2. You must be the new engine, I take it. My name is Orville. Who might you be? The engine just looked at Orville and was disgusted. Oh, uh, was it something I said, old chap? Oh, no, I'm so surprised that the railway, or this part of the railway, uh, still runs old-fashioned diesel engines. I beg your pardon? Gary, move. You're late with the limited anyways. Head to Sodor. Get out of here. And with that, Gary left. Outdated indeed. <laughs> Who was that ignoramus, Sona? That was Gary. He's the newest addition to this huge trial that Limited is hosting out. He's quite frankly an ignorant jerk and a selfish brute. Oh yes, I was working with Shane a couple of weeks ago and boy did he start wanting to destroy Gary for calling him old and useless. He's mean to all aging diesels. Well. I think he needs to be taught a lesson, don't you? What did you have in mind? You want me to do what? Ask your driver to contact Sunstar and have him meet us at Barrow. Are you on bad fuel? I am not going to do that. If you want help, find someone else to do it. And with that, cock off the north left. Oh, for heaven's sake. There goes my plan right down the drain. W what about me? What do you suggest? Why don't you take the mainland limited yourself to Sodor and teach that radio data a lesson about calling you old? Excellent idea, okay. And Orville put London's plan into motion. But when he arrived in Vickerstown, he was greeted by the fat controller of the Northwestern Railway, and he was not very happy to see Orville. You must be Orville. Your controller had informed me that you were coming with my mainline limited, and even he is not too happy to hear about what your decision is. Let me make this clear to you. I do not approve of your methods in stealing my train, but your controller has asked me to let you stay the night here. So that is the plan. But I never want to see you on my railway again. Understand? Yes, sir. My apologies. That night, Orville was at the shed. He felt bad about his first attempt to teach Gary a lesson, when all of a sudden, a small green saddle tank puffed in. Hello there! I haven't seen you around here before. My name is Percy. What's yours? It's, uh, Orville. What's wrong, Orville? There's a new diesel in the yard, and he thinks my friends and I are past it. I want to teach him a lesson, but I'll be damned if I can think of anything. Well, use the coaches or trucks against him. That's how I got Diesel kicked out of soda the first time. Wait, that was you? Oh, I should have known a steamy would get me kicked out. Goodness gracious. Percy, that's fantastic. Thank you. Not a problem, Mr. Popcorn. Oh, it's, uh... uh never mind. So when Orville arrived home, he told the coaches a lie about Gary. Excuse me, coaches, but I hear tell that Gary finds you old and past it. I wouldn't stand for it if I were you. He did, did he? Useless machine. Uh, I've never trusted that Gary anyways. We need to plot. And plotting they did. When Gary went to back down onto the train, 
the coaches put their plan into motion. As soon as the guard blew his whistle, the coaches put their brakes on and sent Gary off the rails. Blast it! I hate you coaches. You're just as useless as the other antique diesels on this. Outdated and useless diesels, eh? Just then, the yard manager and the mainline CEO were there. My mainline engines and Connor's Orville have proven to be more reliable, far more than you can right now. You shall be the one outdated pretty soon. Report to your shed immediately. For the rest of you, please let me know if something like this ever happens again. And we'll deal with it immediately. As for you, Orville, as long as your little stunt you pulled yesterday remains an isolated incident, say nothing more. And Orville agreed. And that, my friend, was that. Guys, guys, guys! Guess who I just met? Shush, Percy. Thomas and Gordon have an announcement. Thank you, Edward. As most of you know, Thomas, Flying Scotsman, Croven, and I went to see Lady the Magical Engine to help with a mysterious engine record. And your point is? Well, James, Lady warns us to be careful of what, Thomas? Lady fears that there could be dark gold dust in the midst of this ordeal. Hmm. <laughs> Dark gold us. I thought that was a myth, Thomas. So did she. Well, Splodge, it looks like we're heading to the mainland for the dark gold us. Make sure you get PT Boomer as well. Uh, sure thing, boss. Uh, right away, boss. Um, I hate to interrupt our Steam Team meeting, but does anyone know why these old Ten and Spider and Dodge are going to the mainland? Oh no, Gordon. I think Diesel 10 is on his way. Everyone, pack your tenders and bunkers. We're going to Roseworth. <laughs> <laughs>